The climb is the same all over the world. It doesn't matter where you are, where you're going. The climb is too long. It's too hard. It's too hot. It's too cold. It's too steep. This thing sucks. It twists and it turns up this massive mountain like a serpent from the underworld that has been cast to challenge you to a duel of death. But you set out every weekend. You buckle your helmet, you strap your shoes, you grab your bike to set out and to conquer this climb. You know every crack, every crevice, every leaf, every tree because you've spent hours and hours out on this climb. But for some reason, it's able to extend itself a few extra turns every single time you hit this thing. Often you're alone. Other times you're with friends. But it doesn't matter because the experience is the same. It sucks. It's the worst. And isn't this what cycling is about? is to overcome those dark demons. This serpent throws these at you and throws them at your psyche to, to demoralize you, telling you to turn around, stop, go back, go home, go be warm. But you don't, and you push through that. And in those times of complete and utter despair, you find a new level of consciousness, a new level of strength that you didn't know you had. And isn't this why we tackled the climb? Even though it may seem like an enemy, it is truly a friend because it helps us grow and become stronger and have memories and bond together. You may not know it, but we've rode together. We all have. We've all climbed the climb and descended the descent. And I promise you that next weekend, no matter where you are in the world, we will ride together because we all are addicted to the climb.